Hi, my name's Ted Patrick. I'm a technical evangelist with Adobe. And I wanted to talk to you about uh, one of the newest smartphones entering the market, the Motorola Droid X on Verizon. Today, we're gonna take a look at Flash Player 10.1 running on this device. And I'm gonna show you some great Flash content. Let's get started. Let's take a look at some games optimized for mobile on Congregate. So here we are at Gridshock. Uh, and as you can see, I just single touched on the flash element. It's gone full screen on this great screen. I click on new game. It's an excellent use of touch and interactivity. There's customized sounds with the gameplay. And at a point, you, lo you lose the fact that you're actually on the web playing a game. And this becomes really a, a complete experience with the device. The game is actually sized to screen um, and basically uses uh, screen information, device information, to provide a really great gaming experience. So let's go press the back button and we're back on Congregate. We're gonna take a look at another game called Fat Slice Mobile. A single tap on the game itself uh, to go full screen. And on the game, you simply use your finger and touch to define an area that slices off part of the game board. And you have to be quick about it. And as you progress through the game, you have to continue to slice uh, without these balls hitting your finger. So it's, it's actually quite an interesting, fun game uh, and you know, pretty good use of interactivity. So here we are at the AP World Cup coverage. It's a full screen application experience that provides game feedback and feeds of covering the World Cup soccer tournament. You simply put in your home country and it will give you specific feeds and views of all the games and all the scores and all the details. So let's drill in. Slovenia and the United States just played. So I can click on that game and it actually gives me all the statistics of the game in kind of a discrete summary. We can go back and we can also check on the full tournament to see the full brackets and where all the countries are in the different groups. What's also nice about this app is that there are live data feeds, uh, so you can get photos, video, and news, and anytime someone scores, straight to your mobile device. And there you have it, the full open web running on Flash Player 10.1 on the Droid X. Flash Player 10.1 and Android 2.2 will be coming to the Droid X late summer. If you're interested in developing for these devices and others, please visit the Adobe Developer Connection to learn more. Thanks.